सो हेलो एवरी वन एज वी नो दैट लेस देन थर्टी डेज आर लेफ्ट फॉर यूर नाबार्ड ग्रेडेड ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर एग्जाम द वन थिंग विच इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर फेज वन एग्जामिनेशन इज टू अंडरस्टैंड वॉट आर दी कट ऑफ्स फ्रॉम विच यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड यूर ओवरऑल प्रिपेरेशन फॉर ईच ऑफ द सेक्शन ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड इन ऑल द रेगुलेटरी बॉडीज एग्जाम फॉर आर बी आई सेबी एंड नाबार्ड द लार्जेस्ट नंबर ऑफ सेक्शन इन फेज वन एग्जामिनेशन आर सरप्राइजिंगली इन नाबार्ड ग्रेड एग्जाम there are eight sections which you could see here which includes e1 reasoning english computer knowledge quantitative aptitude decision making these are its qualifying section first five sections are qualifying in nature the ne- last three sections 6 7 8 that is ga esi and agriculture are merit sections so i hope that you are knowing exam pattern well when we talk about the exam pattern this s- qualifying section is just for your qualification that is each section you have to clear the sectional cut offs only the tally of these marks will not be considered the merit cut off is of these three sections and these three sections your total marks which you will score out of all of these three sections in merit section will be counted so that you will go into the phase 2 examination we all know this and that is why it becomes very very important in nabard grade a phase 1 exam see if you prepare strategically it would be very easy to clear phase 1 exam but agar aap random preparation karke jaoge agar aapko cut off bhi pata nahi hai kis section ka kitna hai which qualifying section or merit section where to concentrate more agar aapko ye pata nahi hai neither you will be able to allocate a target score for you and neither you will understand which of these exact sections are important and in these important sections which are your weakness or strength so for that cut off analysis is required and we are bringing that is why this particular video which is one of the most important video for phase 1 preparation that is yes cut off analysis in this we will understand what are the cut offs of each of these phase 1 sections now we all know total number of questions marks and here when you look at reasoning your computer knowledge quantitative aptitude ga are for 20 marks english is for 30 decision making is for 10 and esi and ard which are the pillars of nabard these are for 40 marks try to understand when you look at the order of the priority of subjects your merit subjects should be your first priority why because merit subjects the overall tally of these 100 marks 40 plus 40 plus 20 that is 100 out of this 100 a merit cut off would be there that merit cut off you have to clear if you are not able to clear you will not go for phase 2 so ga esi and ard is your top priority individually you have to clear the sectional cut offs too but at the same time you have to also clear the overall cut off so it means that in either of the two subjects you have to be very very strong so that you are able to clear the overall cut off when it comes to qualifying section reasoning english computer knowledge quant and decision making here if you see the cut offs which i will show you for last 3 years you will understand that the cut offs are very easy to clear just you have to give equal weightage as well as dedication for each of this section aise nahi karna hai ki ek section pe concentrate kiya to dusre pe nahi okay all of these sections are very very important there have been times in nabard for example in 2020 many of the people ignored computer knowledge and there were maximum students jo ki computer knowledge mein hi fail ho chuke the so computer seems to be a very easy subject but it can also actually Uh, uh like fail you in your phase 1 exam the video continues in just 10 seconds guys if you are a nabard grade 2024 aspirant preparing for nabard grade this year definitely go on olibord website and check out our courses we have launched courses dedicatedly for all the students according to their needs so we have launched nabard grade 2024 learn pack so that you will have all the resources like notes top curated tests for your preparation we have launched recent crash course for nabard grade 2024 in this last 30 to 40 days we will cover all the syllabus for phase 1 and then we will cover overall syllabus also for phase 1 and phase 2 we also have the complete course for nabard grade 2024 so you can choose out any of the courses and definitely start your preparation now you can watch the video now once we understand the exam pattern this is the overall cut off analysis which we are going to do so look at it these are the total marks these are all your sections and this is the total the dark here the light sky blue color section is your merit section and here the uh, the lighter shade of blue these five sections are your qualifying section let us one by one uh, try to see 
what is the overall uh, what is the overall status of each of the section for NABARD grade A phase one exam. So quant 20 marks is the allocation for quant. In 2021 for quant the cutoff was 5. In 2022 the cutoff was 3 and in 2023 the cutoff was again 3 marks. So here you can understand for quantitative aptitude the cutoff is in in the range of 3 to 5. So seems like you have to at least solve 6 to 8 marks or 6 to 8 questions so that you clear the quant cutoff very easily. Through this cutoff in this way you can come to a target score where you can prepare also in the same way. There is one advantage which is in NABARD grade A phase 1 exam that for any of these sectional uh, any of these sections there is no sectional timing. Here there is sectional timing. Nahi hota hai. Aap chahiye to reasoning chudaiye, aap chahiye to English chudaiye. Whenever you want you can switch to the sections also. Whereas in RBI when we look at first you have to solve a section within that sectional time then only you can move to the next section. Here in NABARD that case is not there. You have given the uh, independence as well as little bit your time is also there so that you can give the sections according to your own wish. For example a student is uh, very good in quant and if within good uh, good time he solves quant question then quickly he can switch to ESI, quickly he can sw switch to ARD. So in this way quant cutoff we understand. Reasoning cutoff similarly 20 marks are there. The cutoff is 3.75 in 2021. 2022 3.75 and again 3 in the year of 2023. So when you are looking at the cutoff again the range is almost 3 marks. So here you will understand again how much you have to score or how much questions you have to solve for reasoning almost 5 to 6 questions you have to solve. English when we are talking about 30 marks when I talk about English it is that subject which is more scoring rather than just clearing the cutoff right. But as you know the sectional cutoff is not concerned for us for scoring the marks. Aapko bas cutoff clear karna hai. Okay, so in reasoning out of 30, the cutoff is 11.25, 12.50, 10.50. So the logic is in English also many students may fail if they attempt only 5 questions or 6 questions. So in NABARD grade A phase 1 exam, in qualifying section, aapko confident rehna padega aur aapko ye pata hona chahiye ki har ek section ka cutoff kitna hai. For example, agar quant ka cutoff 3 se 5 marks hai, if the quant cutoff is 3 to 5 marks, there is no point and there is no logic of solving 10 questions of quant and if you do that you will definitely will not clear the phase 1 exam. Similarly in English as it is a easy section you cannot just solve 5 to 8 questions or 10 questions the cutoff is 12 or 11 marks. So in this way 100% you have to uh, solve 15 questions at least in English. Computer knowledge the cutoff is again 3.25, 5.5 and 2. So the cutoff ranges till 5. Again for computer also I will recommend that you have to solve 8. So section wise your strategy should be there. Not like maybe RBI grade B or maybe SEBI grade A exam. Your section, your sectional analysis is very important. If the cutoff for quant is not beyond 5 marks, there is no point of solving 10 questions for quant because qualifying ke to marks aapke consider bhi nahi honge. When it comes to your merit section, that time you have to take care. Yaha par aapke total tally marks would be counted. So therefore in general awareness also if the cutoff is around 3 marks, 3.25 was the highest in the year of 2022, latest was 2.75. So in general awareness you have to keep a target score above 10 marks. Now cutoff is only 3, why I am telling you to keep a target score of 10? The reason is because as we all know the marks you will get in general awareness, ESI and ARD all will be made a tally and that would be compared with your merit cutoff, total merit cutoff and then it will be decided that will you clear phase 1 or not. So general awareness keep a target of 10, economic and social issues that is ESI, out of 40 the cutoff is 4.5, 2.5 and 3.5. This shows that ESI which is current oriented more for phase 1 exam, PIB news, government scheme that is what will come in ESI MCQs. And when this section is considered again it is also scoring I will recommend that the target score for ESI should be 30 plus marks out of 40. Yes you heard me right. Always you have to score well in ESI and ARD because it will also give you confident that you are ready for phase 2 examination in phase 2 also 50 marks objective is there for ESI and ARD. Now agriculture and rural development also here the cutoff is little bit higher 
it shows that 6.5, 6.75 and 4.2. This cutoff shows that it means the AID which is static. Less current affairs questions are there. Out of 40, only 3 to 4 current affairs questions will be there. The rest would be static in nature. And your 6 marks, many of the students on an average get 15 marks. Okay, because easy, moderate, that level questions are there in agriculture and rural development. So overall your strategy should be in general awareness, economic issue and agriculture and rural development. You get such a marks that you will be able to clear your total merit cutoff. Now let us see what are total merit cutoff. Here the total merit cutoff out of these 100 marks, 20 plus 40 plus 40, okay. In 2021 was 53.5. In 2022 was 41.75. And in 2023 it was 46.0 marks. So if the previous total cutoff was 46, how can you get 46 marks from general awareness, ESI and ARD? Very simple. See, I will tell you logical, one of the most minimalistic thing to do so that you can clear phase one, merit cutoff, total merit cutoff. In GA, if you get 10 plus marks, okay? Kuch jada maang rahe hum, nahi maang rahe. Simple. GA mein 10 plus marks leke hao. Then, in economic and social issues, 25 plus marks. Main 30 plus bhi nahi keh Bring 25 plus marks. And in ARD, try to bring 30 plus marks. Jo ki bhoat hi zada possible hai, kyunki ARD mein difficult questions are only 5 to 8 difficult questions. Rest are moderate and easy. So in this way, look at it. 55 plus 10, 65 marks margin. Yani ki agar cut off apka 53.5, jase in the year of 2021 bhi gaya hai, then also you will clear the cutoff very easily with 65 marks. So this is the cutoff analysis for your phase 1 exam dedicatedly. I hope that this session was useful for you to understand how each qualifying section you will be able to clear and at the same time how will you clear the overall merit cutoff also. This will help you a lot to set a target score to understand each of the sections to understand each of the cutoffs. I will now move from the screen so that you can take a screenshot of this. Always remember guys your target score for GA should be 10 plus. ESI 25 plus, ARD 30 plus, which will get you 65 plus marks. Aram se up total cutoff, look at all the three years you can clear with a huge margin. So take a screenshot here. I hope that you have taken the screenshot. And now we will meet next time with one more important session for NABAD grade A 2024.